Good morning, graduates, parents, teachers, guests, and friends. Welcome to Binabangsa Preschool 4th Moving Update. I am pleased that you are all here to join us in this virtual graduation. I am Ms. Joan and I will be your host for today's event. To begin our ceremony this morning, selected K2 children will lead the doxology. Let us welcome the stars of today's ceremonies. Ladies and gentlemen, the Binabangsa graduates of 2021. Please rise for the singing of the national anthem to be led by Zoe Abigail Tanoko.
you. Please be seated. Now, let us listen to Nasa Emma Wang for the opening speech. To our administrators, principals, teachers, parents, guests, friends, ladies and gentlemen, good morning! Welcome to the Binabangsa Preschool Mala Virtual Moving Up Day. This whole academic year, we all learn through online classes. Though we miss going to school, we still remain happy and look forward to seeing our friends and teachers because we still learn and do fun things together. Though this moving up day may not be what we have hoped for, we are grateful for everyone who are celebrating with us today. On behalf of my friends, thank you for joining us on this special day. We hope that you will enjoy watching with us as we remember all the happy memories we had in preschool. So sit back, relax, and enjoy the program. Once again, thank you very much. Thank you, Nisa. It is my privilege to welcome Mr. Hendro Vijaya, the Superintendent Operations of Binabangsa, for an inspirational talk. Good morning. It is an honor for me to welcome students, parents, family members, and members of the school board here today. Before I present my remarks, I would like to take this opportunity to thank principal, teachers, and of course, parents who are committed to the success of every student and continue to take a personal interest in their academic and social development. Graduates, congratulations. You are true brave warriors who keep on fighting to pursue your dreams. You are a generation who are not afraid of anything. Even a COVID-19 cannot stop you from graduating. For this, we're really proud of you. Graduation is an occasion of feelings, a mixture of delight and melancholy. I'm sorry that we cannot celebrate graduation in a big hall to relish this moment. But the sense of hope, I believe, will stay the same. I know that all of you are ready for this moment and you are ready for the next chapter of your life. This graduation is not the end. This is a new beginning for a new chapter of your next level of education. After this, you'll have many academic and life decisions to make. I want you to always remember this. Look into the past, reflect, enjoy the moment, be grateful now, and look forward to the future. Please take a moment to look back and remember the times that have made you who you are. Remember the people who have helped you to get to this stage. Remember both the good times and the bad, because those memories help us make resilient as we face the future ahead. After you've taken the time to look back, now take a moment and enjoy the fact that you are graduating now. You've made it. You have reached this moment by your dedication to succeed, by using your unique gift to accomplish your goals. Some of you will continue your next level of education with us, where some of you will leave us and start to embark on new chapter. Look into the future. Remember, you cannot climb the ladder of success with your hands in your pockets. Get out there and continue to do something great. Congratulations to each member of graduating class and their families. May you continue to experience great success in your future endeavor and remember that like faith, 
a great education is empty if it does not affect the way we live our lives. Congratulations, graduates. Well done. Let us now welcome our preschool acting principal, Ms. Patty Beltran, for her message to the graduates. Good morning, children, parents, and teachers. The academic year 2020 to 21 has been a time of learning and growth for our children, parents, and teachers. As COVID-19 changed our usual routine, this year was a chance for us to come together and to discover new opportunities for learning and teaching our students without being in the classroom together. Our children experienced a great deal of change due to the pandemic and shifting to home-based learning. It was not easy, but our children took those changes in stride. Thank you, dear K2 children, for doing your best, working with your teachers and your big smiling faces that give us teachers positive energy during online classes. We are proud of the way that you have diligently attended our classes, followed your teachers, participated all our activities, and you have easily navigated through Zoom. Binabangsa Preschool Malang owes our K-2 children's success to our teachers' dedication and the overwhelming support of our parents. Our dear parents have been immensely supportive and we cannot thank you enough for your solidarity, time, patience, and kindness as we cheered on each other and stayed on track this year. We thank you everyone from the bottom of our hearts. You have helped us create a foundation for our K2 children to build upon for years to come. To our dear parents and teachers, we hope you know that we truly appreciate you and that you have made this year absolutely unforgettable. This year, our K-2 children did not only learn to read and write, but more importantly, they have learned to persevere, to be independent, to have fun with their friends and teachers, and to show love to their families. They have learned a lot and have shown eagerness to head to primary one. We have loved and enjoyed watching our K-2 children grow in various areas of development. So let us indeed take this time to celebrate their achievements. So to our dear graduates, take on challenges, be loving, love learning, be happy, and be all you can be. Congratulations, dear graduates. Let's give everyone a big cheer. Hip, hip, hooray! At this point, I have the honor to present to you the mother of Ruth, Miss Ariani Tree Murastari, who will share her personal testimony. Hi everyone, my name is Ariani, and sitting next to me is my daughter Ruth. Hi Ruth, um, can you please introduce yourself? Okay. Hi everyone, my name is Ruth. I'm a K2 student at Pinabansa School in Mala. <laughs> Thank you, Ruth. Right, we are here to give you a testimony about the schooling at Binabangsa School in Malang. As for me, a parent, I'm very grateful to see my daughter enjoying her school time very much. Um, I can see that my daughter engages very well in all school and classroom activities. Um, she is brave to raise her hands, um, to answer or ask questions. She loves to tell stories um, to her teachers and friends. She is a very happy student. And for me, that all matters. Because I believe only happy students can learn and grow the best. And Binabangsa School Malang ensures happy and supportive learning environment to all students, including to my daughter. Ruth, um, are you happy to schooling at Binabangsa School Mala? Yes, I am. Because all my teachers are nice. They help me and listen to my stories. Yes, that's right. And the most important thing is, in this uncertain time of COVID-19 pandemic, 
I'm very thankful to all Bina Bangsa School Malang teachers and staff um, for providing us with their best service to deliver quality education to all students. Uh, my daughter can still learn very well even through online learning platform and her teachers care very much to every student's progress in this online learning. If one student, for example, has difficulty in grasping the lesson, uh, the teachers then will spend more time to help the student and to make sure no students are left behind. And that is very important in education, uh, to make sure that our children can learn. Okay, Ruth, um, do you have your final words for us? Yes! I love Vina Bangsa School so much! Right, that's all from us. Thank you very much everyone and stay safe. Bye! Bye! -bye. <laughs> Thank you very much, Miss Ariani. Let us listen to what our K2s have to say. Three chosen children will deliver their graduation speech. Each will deliver their speech in a different language. First, let us listen to a graduation speech in English. The speech will be delivered by Ruth Eliana Sunarwoto. To our school administrators, principals, teachers, parents, friends, guests, ladies and gentlemen, a lovely morning to all of you. I am Ruth Eliana Sunarwato from Gato Victory. Today we are delighted to have you with us on our virtual moving up day. I remember when we were in school. I will run and play outside with my friends. But because of the pandemic, we needed to stay and have online classes with our teachers. Although we miss going to school. We could still learn and have our fun class activities and celebrate special events. <clears throat> we enjoy doing art and movement activities, playing games, dressing up, singing, dancing, and cooking with our friends and teachers. We did all of these during our online classes. We will treasure all of these experiences which help us grow physically, mentally, and socially. Our teachers have taught us moral values and skills that will help us in our journey ahead. My friends and I are now more confident to move on and continue our journey in primary. Thank you, dear teachers. We also want to express our gratitude to our dear parents. Thank you for your love, care, and support. Thank you for doing everything possible to help us become our best selves. Thank you, moms and dads. We love you. Lastly, to my friends, congratulations. Here we go, everyone. Thank you, Ruth. Well done. Our second speaker will deliver his speech in Mandarin. Let us welcome Nicholas Billy Wijaya. Xiao 说我们毕业的心情现在我们要上小学了 
的每一件事情。小朋友，你们准备好了吗？我准备好了。谢谢大家。谢谢 Billy. 很好 Last but not least, let us listen to Crystal Kurniadi Vijaya, who will deliver her speech in Bahasa Indonesia. Pagi Ibu Vera, Miss Betty, guru-guru, teman-teman, dan Papa Mama. Saya Crystal Kurniadi Vijaya. Saya bersekolah di Binang Bangsa. Mulai dari pre-nursery hingga ini saya di K2. Saya sangat senang bersekolah di Binang Bangsa karena dapat belajar bagai bahasa. Seperti bahasa Inggris, bahasa Mandarin, dan bahasa Indonesia. Selain itu, Binang Bangsa mempunyai Kelas yang sangat nyaman untuk belajar dan juga memiliki berbagai jenis mainan. Guru-guru di Binang Bangsa juga sangat baik. Mereka selalu sabar mendidik kami. Saya mewakili teman-teman ingin menyampaikan terima kasih kepada guru-guru untuk ilmu kasih sayang yang telah kami dapatkan jasamu akan kami ingat selalu tak lupa saya sampaikan terima kasih kepada papa mama karena selalu menyayangiku memimingku dan memberi semua yang terbaik untukku. Terima kasih guruku. Terima kasih orang tuaku. Terima kasih teman-teman. Tuhan memberkati. Terima kasih Crystal. Bagus sekali. May we call on Miss Patria Beltran, our preschool acting principal, Mr. Hendro Vijaya the Superintendent Operations of Bina Bangsa for the presentation and confirmation of the graduates. Mr. Hendra, I have the honor to present to you six boys and eight girls. They have satisfactorily completed the requirements set by Bina Bangsa School. By the power vested in me by the Board of Trustees, I now confirm you, graduates, congratulations. Congratulations, dear graduates. We will now proceed with the awarding of diplomas and medals. Mr. and Ms. Responsible, Nicholas Billy Vijay, Jaconia Harold Videlis, Christelle Corniadi Vijay, and Mesa Emma Wang. Mr. and Ms. Responsible can be trusted and depended upon. They have the ability to look after themselves and are always ready to lend a hand without being told to. Mr. and Miss Responsible Mr. and Miss Amiable Adolf Sigiarto Glenn Luis Gunawa Nasha Ellen Pintarto and Zoe Abigail Tanoko Mr. and Miss Amiable show pleasant and good-natured personal qualities. They diffuse warmth and friendliness. They possess sweetness of disposition and kind-heartedness which made them to be likable. Mr. and Miss Independent Flynn Samuel Chang Ruth Eliana Sunarwoto and Elena Chen Mr. and Miss Independent show responsibility for their own learning. They are driven by their own personal achievement and don't easily give up. They strive to carry out assigned duties and understand a concept as much as possible on their own before asking for help. 
Mr. and Miss Artistic, Clayton Kurniawan Cristanto, Clara Evangelista Harianto, and Kimberly Emanuela Conroy. Mr. and Miss Artistic show a wide range of interest and creativity. They show great imagination and natural creative skill. They have creative and productive talent. Mr. and Miss Artistic. Let us give our graduates a big round of applause. <laughs> to showcase their language skills, selected K2 graduates have prepared short performances in English, Mandarin, and in Bahasa Indonesia. First, let us listen to a poem in English entitled, I Have to Be Me. The poem will be delivered by Ruth Eliana Sunarwoto, Nesa Emma Wang, Adolf Sugiarto, and Flynn Samuel Chang. I have to be me. I can fish in a head. I can fish in a pot. I can fish in the dish. If I wish, why not? I can play and get wet. And I do it a lot. If I want, I may play, but then I may not. I can help with my bed, and I do it my way. I can sing while I hit, I can and I me. I can be what I want, I can do what I do. I have to be me, and you have to be you. Thank you, boys and girls. That was superb. Our second presentation will be a poem in Mandarin, entitled Di Ye Shi, or Graduation Poem. It will be delivered by Nicholas Billy Wijaya, Elena Chen, and Kimberly Emanuela Conroy. Our third presentation will be a song in Bahasa Indonesia entitled Guruku Tersaya. It will be delivered by Crystal Kurnia Divijaya, Zoe Abigail Tanoho, and Jaconia Harold Videlis.
Terima kasih anak-anak. Bagus sekali. Please pay attention to the screen and have a glimpse of our graduates in Binabang's school as they take you to the past. child's first school. Moms and dads are their first teachers. As parents, you have always played an important role in your child's life. You've provided them with all the love and care and helped them become the children they are now. At this point, we will be taking a trip down memory lane. Please take with you the memorable and fun times you have spent with your children in preschool. Before we end our virtual graduation program, let us all listen to Flynn Samuel Chang for the closing speech. Before this program ends, I would like to express gratitude to the following people who have helped us succeed in our preschool years to all the school staff, 
Thank you for helping us with all our fair drawings, school events, and activities. To our dear teachers, thank you for your patience, love, and guidance. We will never forget all the things you have taught us. To my friends, thank you. Thank you for all the fun memories we had together. I will see you all again in primary one. To our loving parents, thank you for your guidance, love and support. Thank you for giving us a beautiful home and a school. To everyone present in this Moving Up Day celebration, thank you for celebrating with us. Most of all, we thank you, God, for your great love for all of us. Once again, thank you everyone for making this event extra special to all of us. Thank you, Flynn. BBS Preschool Malang wishes all the graduates well to a new and wonderful journey in Primary 1. Once again, congratulations, dear graduates. We are all proud of you.